A NASA camera aboard the Deep Space Climate Observatory Xcaver, satellite captured a unique view of the Moon as it moved in front of the sunlit side of Earth last month. The series of test images shows the fully illuminated dark side of the Moon that is never visible from Earth. The images were captured by NASA's Earth Polychromatic Imaging Camera EPIC, a 4-megapixel CCD camera and telescope on the Xcaver satellite orbiting 1 million miles from Earth. From its position between the Sun and Earth, Xcaver conducts its primary mission of real-time solar wind monitoring for the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration NOAA. EPIC maintains a constant view of the fully illuminated Earth as it rotates, providing scientific observations of ozone, vegetation, cloud height, and aerosols in the atmosphere. Once EPIC begins regular observations next month, the camera will provide a series of Earth images allowing study of daily variations over the entire globe. About twice a year the camera will capture the Moon and Earth together as the orbit of Xcaver crosses the orbital plane of the Moon. These images were taken between 3.50 pm and 8.45 pm EDT on July 16, showing the Moon moving over the Pacific Ocean near North America. The North Pole is in the upper left corner of the image, reflecting the orbital tilt of Earth from the vantage point of the spacecraft. The far side of the Moon was not seen until 1959 when the Soviet Luna 3 spacecraft returned the first images. Since then, several NASA missions have imaged the lunar far side in great detail. The same side of the Moon always faces an Earth-bound observer because the Moon is tidally locked to Earth. That means its orbital period is the same as its rotation around its axis. In May 2008 NASA's Deep Impact spacecraft captured a similar view of Earth and the Moon from a distance of 31 million miles away. The series of images showed the Moon passing in front of our home planet when it was only partially illuminated by the Sun. EPIC's natural color images of Earth are generated by combining three separate monochrome exposures taken by the camera in quick succession. EPIC takes a series of 10 images using different narrowband spectral filters from ultraviolet to near-infrared to produce a variety of science products. The red, green, and blue channel images are used in these color images. 